Hi, my name is Parker, the developer and creator of Twos, the best place to write, remember, and share things. After many requests, we're excited to finally announce that you can now use boards and grid views in Twos. This is in addition to the traditional list view. Let me show you how they work. So Twos is a simple system of days, lists, and things to easily organize all of the things going on in your life or that you need to remember. You write things down on lists like today, or book notes like now you can change the layout of your list like for example if I was looking at all of the books that I read in 2023 these are just sublist things and if I wanted to use one of the new layouts I can go into the list actions and then here I'll see the different layouts so I can change it to grid and we'll see the books are now laid out in a grid and these cards or list previews if there's a photo in the list or the list has a list preview then you'll see the photo if not then you'll just see essentially a preview of that list these can also be selected like if i wanted to move them somewhere else or i wanted to nest them inside of their own sub list and you can also just reorder them if i held one down and moved it around maybe i want this one up here you can just reorder it like a normal list with things. If I want to use the board, the board view is more like a traditional Kanban view where you have columns. Kanbans usually have cards, but again, we just have our normal things. This was made popular by a tool named Trello, which is great for product management. So this is great for product management. If you want to have stages of a project and you're moving things across the stages, for example, I set up a dev board just for an example and we can see I have a backlog and up next in progress and done if I complete any of these things then I can just drag it across into done and again you can just add things to the board maybe you don't know where you're going to organize them yet or you just want to jot down some notes you can add that like a normal list at the bottom so the grid and the columns of the board are essentially just sub lists and any of these columns can be just opened standalone like a normal list as well. So that's where you change it for a list. For today, it's a little bit different because it's a, le a little less likely that you'll be using it there. Where you can find it in list actions, more options, under the actions tab, there's gonna be a layout section where you can change between grid, list, board. This is now available on iOS and web. I can show a little bit of how it works on mobile. So we can see that it's a little bit different. The grid is currently just a list, essentially. You also can't reorder, so that's a little bit trickier, but you can select and use the reorders here. If I press down, you can also just turn it into a normal list and do some reorders. It'll be out on desktop and Android soon. We're still tweaking it a bit, making some fixes. You can see some spacing things that are off, but we're excited to hear what you think. Let us know if you have any questions or what you want to see next. Thank you so much for watching and have a happy Tuesday.